Okay, I don't normally make these types of videos, but this is a special occasion. I am kind of geeking out right now. I just drove about an hour and a half to get here to the Nurburgring, and I'm a kid in a candy store right now. I have never believed ever in my life that I would be in this position. Even being here in Germany right now is just a random crack shoot, to be honest. I got a call at 7 a.m. back in America because someone else got sick for my team and they're like, yo, can you book a flight to get here to Germany now? <laughs> and in less than 12 hours, I was on my way to Germany to cover for an event for a business trip. Then I, and somewhere along the way, I was thinking to myself, like, what would I want to do with an extra day or two in Germany? And I don't know why, but a lot of my team members know I'm a car person. I've been racing cars for a very long time, but it didn't even click to my head that the number ring was even an option. Like, I didn't even think about it. Maybe just because I was stressed out making sure this event's going to go well and making sure I can perform well there. But <laughs> I didn't even have to look. I didn't even look it up how close it was. As it turns out, it was pretty close. I flew into Cologne, Germany for an event. And holy shit, is this place cool. Even just the drive here was just serene, beautiful, iconic. Just <laughs> these quaint little German towns everywhere you go. And the road was twisty and pretty cool too. But now that I'm here, I've been here I'm actually a little bit early, but <laughs> maybe that's just because I'm excited. I just try to check in. They're like, yo, you're about an hour and a half early. Maybe go get a snack or something. So I'm gonna go try to do that now. In the meantime, I am still just in awe of everything that's going on around me. The shop I went to, I was sitting there for like 30 minutes, realizing I was in the wrong place. After someone came up to me, I just hear German, I don't speak German, I don't really know anything. I just hear people talking. I introduced myself, the lady was nice, she gave me coffee. But what's really cool to me is that this is the race world. I see BMWs everywhere. And it's so funny to think that these are probably something like the Toyota or Corolla of Germany. <laughs> but, okay, apparently there's a limit on how, much, how long of a video I can make. I was mentioning, every one of these cars around me has big brake kits. Uh, they're all gutted, carbon fiber out the wazoo, a lot of E36s, E46s, but some E90s. This is going to be the crazy experience of my life. I've probably played thousands of hours of this course virtually in every racing game out there. Enthusia, Gran Turismo, Forza, <laughs> and everything in between. I just am in, I'm in shook. Like, this is my dream. I, I've been a racing instructor now for like eight years. Never in my life would I have imagined that I would have an opportunity to actually be here in Germany on the ring. Let's get this.
holy shit guys <laughs> I just finished my time at the Nerve Ring unreal whatever video game you think you played and tried it doesn't match the bumps the emotions the curbs are way more strict you have to be way more patient on the corners but holy shit can you go flat out in so many areas this is a bucket list item the greatest thing I've ever done in my life you have to do it.